so here we are. We just bought the center blocks for the uh, uh, barbecue grill that we're gonna make. We're gonna load it in a truck and we're gonna get going. Here's all the uh, cinder blocks right now. I'm gonna make the uh, barbecue grill right there. We're gonna stack them up, dry stack. Then we'll put a grate on top and we're good to go. Cineblock grill. I got this thing off Amazon and uh, it can fold it, but I don't need to because it's sitting on the cinder blocks. I might get a little, uh, whatever this measurement is here, a flat, uh, you know, like a flat paver all around. But now we're going to go ahead and test it. We're going to put the, the wood there and uh, we'll see what happens. Maybe we'll cook some burgers today. It's basically all dry stacked. That's all it is. I mean, it's just temporary grill. If it doesn't work here, you could take it out, put it somewhere else. But uh, the, uh, the materials, the cinder blocks, and then the grill, uh, there's about, I'm going to say, $60 uh, worth of material there. But it came out pretty good. All right, we'll go ahead and fire it up and see what happens here. I think it's going to work. How much? Uh, we, get the, we get the wood, the, uh, the, wood, the fire. I think so. <laughs> Actually, it looks pretty good. It looks, no, like, it looks so easy. I 
I'm not casting this for, for, for Zool. Oh, no, no. Even Is it going to work? I think so. Is that a Si tu m'en veux, je Well, once it, it starts burning up a little bit more. There it is, we got the fire going, just burning off this oil here on the top. And then once the embers are there, we'll be ready to throw some burgers and test it out. Just notice on my grill, there's a little indentation there. Hopefully it survives. It's the first burn, there's a lot of oil in here. So, it'll level out. The good news is it's not getting red hot. Because if it was red hot, it means it's melting. So it could stand the heat. Yeah. Homemade burgers up in this grill. Put this together, 20 minutes. We're gonna enjoy some burgers. The primal instincts. A fire, some hardwood, some cedar, you your own barbecue out of cinder blocks, dry stack it, and boom, you got food. Okay, we're gonna take our burgers. Did a good job here. I think with the cedar, it's pretty good. I think it's gonna be juicy. So here's the final result. The burger looks pretty good. It's cooked, it's homemade burger. And all of this was done easily with uh, about 20 cinder blocks and then some pavers. Uh, I might put some pavers all around here, or some more cinder blocks, I should say, to keep the heat in. But other than that, I think it's pretty good. this part here on top and what's happening is it helps radiate the heat the heat is going like this and then coming back so it's circulating here and if I put my hand here it's really a lot hotter than it is over here at the edge so this made a difference if you put your hand back here you can feel it okay so now that I've used this uh, Cineblock grill a lot um, I use it actually on Memorial Day and um, it worked just so much better because I had this right here and the heat was just circulating. And at the time, I didn't have anything higher than this um, brick that I have here. So what I did was um, I went to the hardware store and I bought this right here. It's a solid center block because I found that having just the walls here, the back wall and the side bricks made a huge difference. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get rid of this and put the solid center blocks and then improve it. There you have it, and uh, it looks better. This is a lot more sturdy now, uh, these uh, blocks here on top. And what's gonna happen is it's gonna retain the heat a lot longer as it's gonna bounce off the center block here and create a convection and go ahead and circulate around here so the food is gonna be cooked a lot faster. Uh, this, just having these walls around, 
Uh, this U-shaped wall makes a huge difference. Um, so it's been improved. This is the final stage. This is what it looks like. I think it looks pretty good. Hopefully you've learned something from this video. If you liked it, follow me on YouTube. Put a like, subscribe. And I make videos about everything and anything. And I hope you have enjoyed this video.